We find that so often that sometimes mentors don't realize how powerful that influence of having somebody who cares unconditionally, who's in their corner, who, who is going to be supportive, uh, how important that relationship can be. Because if somebody's not a father, not a mother, not a preacher, not a teacher, is not, has no obligation to come and spend time with you every week, it indicates to that young person that, you know, maybe I am worthwhile, maybe I am worth something, and, and uh, maybe I do have something to offer. Most mentors will tell you that, you know, they really do get a lot out of that relationship, primarily because um, having done something for somebody that cannot do something for you in return uh, is a reward in itself, and uh, that relationship begins to take on a meaning that becomes very powerful. And, uh, and to see that young person grow and to see that young person achieve uh, things that you didn't assume they could ever do and they assumed they could never do uh, is very rewarding. It's one hour a week, and it is one hour a week, so I, would, I wouldn't want to scare anybody away and say, hey, yeah, you're adopting somebody. You're not, but relationships happen, and change happens uh, in, in those relationships for the good. Um, so eventually, it might turn into a relationship that you're inviting the, your mentee over with his family or her family for a barbecue on the weekends. You're attending a church service together. Um, you're sitting down for, for meals ongoing, uh, and you're part of the family. I thank the Teammates Program for putting that relationship in my life. I think in terms of feeling good about something that's happened, I guess this is one thing that uh, we feel very good about, Nancy and I, because we've been able to have some small impact on a fairly large number of kids who in turn will have a fairly large impact on other kids is important.